An eighth grade boy is now charged with murdering a Wisconsin girl in the woods. Investigators today revealed disturbing new details about what happened to 10 year old Lily Peters. Her body was found in Chippewa Falls this week, not far from her aunt's home. WCCO's Kate Reddix explains what we learned about the suspect, suspected killer in court. The juvenile arrested for the murder of Lily Peters appeared in court via video from a juvenile detention center in Eau Claire. We are not showing his face as part of a court order, and his name was not released. The criminal complaint is also sealed. District Attorney Wade Newell told Judge Lane that the 14-year-old defendant, referred to only as CPB, told law enforcement he went with Lily Peters on the walking trail Sunday with the intent to rape and kill her. When he did get off of the trail, punched the, the victim in the stomach, knocked her to the ground, essentially strangled her, hit her with a stick before um, strangling her to the point of death before he then sexually assaulted her. The 14-year-old suspect faces three felony charges, first-degree murder and two charges of sexual assault. Two of the charges have a maximum penalty of life in prison. The defendant, who law enforcement say knew Lily, has dark hair and kept his head down during the hearing. He did not address the court. His attorneys asked for a $100,000 bail. He is 14 and an eighth grader. Uh, he cannot drive. But the prosecutor wanted a $1 million cash bond, which the judge granted. Multiple law enforcement sat in the gallery of the courtroom. It did not appear any of Lily's family were present. I try and be the prosecutor. I would want if something happened to my daughter. And so that's the way I look at things and not try to get too emotionally impacted on it, but just do be professional and do what is necessary to have justice done. In Chippewa Falls, Wisconsin, Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News. The district attorney said that under Wisconsin law, this case will automatically start in adult court, but the defense can ask to have it moved. The next hearing will be on May 5th.